In North Texas, we have one of the most diverse, both ethnically and socioeconomically, patient populations in existence. Over seven million population, over one million children. There are no other academic pediatric hospital in DFW area other than children's health. Things that I read about in textbooks, I actually see them come to life in our emergency department. So the breadth of pathology is amazing here. We tend to see the patient that doesn't fit into that textbook description or definition of what you should be seeing. And so we're constantly learning, we're constantly evolving. Our academic affiliation at Children's Health has always been with UT Southwestern, and that's been a fantastic partnership. It gives children's access to some of the best minds in the world. It was a commitment to invest not only in things to treat the, the common conditions that are run-of-the-mill and are, are high volume, but also to go beyond that and be a center of excellence for diseases that are rare. We are constantly innovating um, and we don't really have a lot of hesitation from bringing things from bench to bedside. But that means recruiting people that are even more sort of a different skill set, different focus, so that we can all kind of complement each other. And, you know, having programs that are unique and innovative that no one else can actually do. We have experts in every type of diagnosis. So we have experts in bone marrow failures, which is a blood disorder. We have experts in blood clots, which is a different type of blood disorder. We have experts in leukemia. We have experts in solid tumors. Having such a big facility here and so many patients, we're able to so specialize. I can get a 3D image of the blood vessels in a baby's brain in 20 minutes. The CAR T-cell program that we've developed here, that has saved a lot of patients' lives. The people the resources, the infrastructure, and then when you add to that the opportunity to really push boundaries of care, that's why I came here. As the complexity has increased, so has our field grown, and last year we established a new ACGME-approved Pediatric Hospital Medicine Fellowship. We have a simulation center here at UT Southwestern. We've incorporated into psychiatry um, for training, so you can um, train in different ways where you couldn't before. We really, really think about new ways to offer new surgical options, new imaging options. We want to be a one-stop shop for everything. And it doesn't just stop there. Not only do we want to be able to do it, we want to be able to do it well. I would put our program up against anybody's. I do have close relationships with people at other centers who do my job, and they know who we are. They know the work that we're doing. Um, they know our name, and they know that we are um, pushing the boundary and really trying to fight to make advancements for kids. If you're passionate about children and you're passionate about improving their outcomes, I think this is the place to be. There's nothing really more satisfying than making a difference in the life of a child, and you're not only helping the, the children, but you're helping the families as well. We're making a difference. I love that fact about my job. People who work in this department really enjoy what they do and you know are the tops in their field. We all kind of bring different things to the table and challenge each other and help each other and um, it's just a lovely environment that I wouldn't change for anything in the world. <laughs> Part of it is also working with residents and fellows. I think that they add a lot to our ability to take care of children. We get to train them and then as they graduate off and go into do fellowships, go into private practice, stay on staff here with us and so it's a, it's a joy. Whether you want to be a clinician, uh, you want to be a you know, clinician educator, or you want to be a physician scientist, it's all here for you. I wanted to be somewhere where I was going to not only utilize the skills that I've made, but also continue to work and grow upon those skills. And when it comes to the newer in interns or medical students, you realize how much you have really learned because there's things that you do just automatically and they have never seen this before. You should finish training here and be able to handle just about anything. Oh, you've done research in this and this and you have two, three papers. Wow! By the time you graduate, no one's going to question your skills. We've taught them to start at the level where we are now and then go to the next level. And then all of a sudden you've got all these people that share a certain philosophy and mindset and ethos that then you can plug in the next generation. It is, it's great.